our lockdown has been extended by another two weeks so take the week we've still got left that is still three weeks that we have to be in this lockdown situation so today i'm going to do the inevitable the the what do you call it the big elephant in the room that's been waiting for me and that is to clean out this garage and uh, i'll show you guys how to do a time lapse afterwards on the eos r but first I have to get these cars out, so let's do it. While I was cleaning out the garage, which was yesterday by the way, I got an idea. I thought to myself, maybe I should paint out the garage and build some sort of a mini YouTube setup uh, to for, you know, going forward. And uh, this is what I came up with. Um, obviously I can't go and buy shelves and everything like that or any lights to put here in the back because of the lockdown situation we find ourselves in. Um, but yeah. This is uh, so far what we're gonna start working with. Let me know what you think. And uh, let's dive into the reason why you are here. And let's check out the time-lapse mode on the Canon EOS R. First off, to get into video mode, we are going to press the mode button on top of your camera and then the info button. This will bring you to the different video modes. If you are not shooting in manual and you don't have any experience with um, aperture priority or shutter priority I suggest you go with the first one and that is the one with the A plus where the camera uh, will control all your settings throughout your time lapse I have made custom adjustments so I'm gonna go with my C1M adjustment next we are gonna click on the menu button as you see at the bottom right at the bottom on the first page movie digital image stabilization is currently enabled we would need to disable that feature otherwise your time-lapse movie mode um, would be grayed out and you won't be able to use it right at the top where it says movie record quality we are going to click on that this option allows you to choose the quality of movie you want you can either go for 4k um, a full HD which is the setting I've got it on 920 by 1080 I'm gonna keep it at 25 frames per second and I always film all my videos in all eye next one down movie cropping we can leave that at disabled sound recording if you would prefer to have your sound on and off or on auto it's up to you time code we won't be using and then your movie digital image stabilization should be disabled Let's go to the second page in the menu and here you will find your time-lapse movie mode as indicated. We're going to click on that. We are going to enable it and we are going to choose uh, 1920 times 1080 which is your full HD setting. Next is your interval. That is literally the seconds in between every time your camera takes an image so at this stage it is set at every three seconds we can change it to every five next one down is your number of shots you would like to take so at this stage it's set at 300 auto exposure here you can set the exposure if you would like it to be fixed on the first frame or changed with every frame um, but I'm shooting indoors, so I'm going to keep mine on fixed on the first frame. Screen auto off, disable. Yeah, you can enable that, especially when you are doing um, long durations of long of time lapses uh, to save your battery power. Then if you look at the little video recorder at the bottom of your screen, you'll see it says 24 minutes and 55 seconds. That is actually the duration your camera would take to capture your, um, your time lapse at an interval of every 5 seconds at 300 shots. And the play button next to it indicates the length of your time lapse. So in this case, our time lapse will be 12 seconds long. If you scroll up, 
there's one last option there which is beep as image taken we can disable that again your camera will just make a beep every time an image is taken once you're ready to go you can press the record button on top of your camera and then you can press the shutter to start the sequence and you're off well that's it from me guys thank you so much for watching if you find this video helpful or useful in any way please give it a like if you are new here consider subscribing and i think because it's a time lapse video we are gonna peace out in time lapse mode peace oh i'm a bit far to get to the camera <laughs>